Hello. <laughs> Do I say hi? Do I say hi over there? Are you not amused? Hi. It is technically today is December 30th, 2022, uh, but this will be going out tomorrow, which will be the last day of 2022. And I wanted to make a video to be able to look back at and uh, maybe even react to and do a another like talk about what my life is like then for the future and next year. 2022 has been a really, really good year for me. Um, I moved out into my first apartment with my amazing boyfriend, Tom Kichi. I got two little kittens, one of which is behind me. The other, I think, is hanging out with Tom Kichi in the living room. I am really close to 30,000 subscribers. I started a ASMR channel that is doing really, really well. Um, I started that, I think, technically the end of last year. Wow. Time flies. <laughs> so I want to, like, ask future me a couple questions. And I also want to state some stuff of, like, I want to ask myself some questions so that, like, I can then ask future me if that makes sense. Okay. So first and foremost... Let's just start with subscribers because I, I said subscriber count already. So I have 29,000 subscribers on this channel, Izumi. I have 11.5 thousand subscribers on Izumi ASMR. And I have like, let me check, one second. And I have 326 subscribers on the 8-Bit Author. I don't post on it really yet. I've, I had like really old vlogs, but I haven't posted on it in like over a year, so... Just in case I start posting on it again, I want to say my subscriber count for that. Oh, they're both behind me now. Here's Raven. I know she kind of blends in. And Puffin. Oh, Rory. I'm 19 years old. I just turned 19 a month ago, and it's kind of crazy. <laughs> Nothing much has changed, but um, I'm kind of finally the age I feel, which is kind of cool. Um, I felt older my entire life. I've kind of felt like I've been in my early 20s since I was like 13. Um, and so I'm almost 20 now. Like next year I'll be 20. You're 20 in the future. Future Jamie, you're 20. Whoa. Okay, so uh, other stuff to talk about that I can reflect on later on. I'm right now creating Internet Crush. Um, I just finished writing the outline for episode 12, I believe. How's internet crush? <laughs> like, is it good? Did I do well? Do people like it? Charmed Academics, I think, just released last... Actually, tomorrow, I think, episode 8 comes out. Let me check. Episode 7. Tomorrow, episode 7 comes out. Because tomorrow is Saturday. And the first episode of Charmed Academics right now has 2.2 thousand views. Which is awesome. My most popular video that's still up on the channel is 18,000 views, and that's episode one of Minecraft High. It's so interesting making a video like this, because I don't know what's going to be different from a year from now, what's going to be the same. It's really strange. <laughs> I almost feel like awkward, because I'm like talking to my future self, but I don't even know who she is yet. I've been working really hard on manifesting the future I want and working really hard for it and um, working with people I really, really enjoy working with. And yeah, uh, Tom Makichi is right now um, in the process of getting his booth built. Me, him, and my dad have been building his vocal booth all together. It's coming along really, really well and I'm really happy that we saved up the money we did to put into it and yeah. He hasn't gotten any professional gigs as of today, um, and I'm curious, has he gotten any professional gigs? I think he will by next year. Or at least some really cool gigs, that's for sure. Okay, now some questions. So that kind of was a question, the whole, like, is, has Tomokichi gotten a professional gig? Slash, what is the coolest gig he's gotten so far? Um, but some personal questions. Do we still live here? Or were we able to get a house like we were really, really hoping for and hoping the housing market would <laughs> go down so we could afford a house? Um, or are we in another apartment? Where do we live? Obviously, don't say where we live online, Jamie. Crazy. But like, where, like, what type of place do we live in? Do we still live here? 
How are the beans? They're right now doing really well. Um, they ate tuna, though, the other day. A tuna treat for the first time. And if you didn't know, tuna can upset cats' stomachs if it's very new to them. And it was the first time they ever had tuna. And so they kind of had the poopies. So they're doing a lot better now. But they kind of kept having accidents. Not a lot. And nothing crazy. But they've never had accidents the entire time we've owned them. Since we've adopted them, they've been little angels. They've never done anything outside a litter box. But after that tuna, ooh, <laughs> it fucked them up a little bit. <laughs> They're doing much better now, though. As you can see, they're just chilling. Trying to think of other questions to ask myself. I don't really know. I don't... Because I know what I'm. my goals are um, for this upcoming year. But I don't really know what to ask, you know? Are your subscribers still, like, the sweetest people in the world? I really hope they are. <laughs> um, you just got... Oh, yesterday you streamed. Um... Two days ago as of this being uploaded, but the other day you streamed and it was the first time you felt like a successful YouTuber in a very long time. Um, and you cried afterwards because you loved it so much. <laughs> have we had more moments like that? And how many members do we have on the channel now too? I guess that's cool to ask. Um, we have seven right now, which is the most I've ever had. It's kind of crazy. My average views are anywhere between 500 to 1,000 views per video on Izumi, and then on Izumi ASMR, it ranges from anywhere from 1,000 to like 10,000, um, which is really, really awesome. And I'm really proud of myself because I've come a really long way from like, if I could talk to me a year ago, I would say it was 50 to 100 views on Izumi, and Izumi ASMR really, I didn't, I didn't do it seriously back then. The year before, I didn't even do YouTube really anymore. Um, I posted Minecraft High, but that was just kind of to fill the void of creativity. Um, it wasn't really to be a YouTuber, if that makes sense. So I wasn't really paying attention to that kind of stuff. Do you believe in yourself? <laughs> that's such a sad, like, that's such a sad question to ask, but... Um, Right now, we are trying to really hard, and I think as every day moves forward, we are definitely believing in ourselves more and more, but do you, like, actually believe in yourself, like, without even trying to? If so, how does that feel? Do we still do a bunch of freelance work to make a living, or are we able to do Izumi full-time? Are we still making graphic design logos and thumbnails, banners, all of that? Or are we able to just do Izumi and, like, writing articles and stuff like that? It's what we don't like to do. <laughs> the writing we don't like. <laughs> are we still having to do that? Or are we able to just do Izumi full-time? Let me know. Okay. I'm now going to give my future self a message, okay? Hi, Jamie. I hope you're doing really well. I hope your body dysmorphia hasn't come back at all this year. I hope your depression has lightened up a lot more. Um, I hope you haven't had a depressive episode in a long time. Um, I hope our anxiety is a lot less. I hope we became less self-conscious of doing certain coping mechanisms to help our mental health. And I hope you realize how proud I am of you. Regardless of where you are, you're still further along than I am. And I'm putting in a lot of work to help us get to where you are. And don't discredit that work. I believe in us. At least I'm trying to. And I hope you're proud of yourself. Because I think you're doing a great job regardless of what you're doing. And I love you. Go to your own Anyways. That's it. 
happy 2023 and to a great 20 wait ha i hope everyone had a good 2022 and have a great 2023 that's what i meant to say and if 2022 wasn't a good year for you make 2023 your bitch i believe in you the beans believe in you they're asleep also, if you're wondering why I'm wearing a Vape Juice brand sweatshirt, it's my sister's old sweatshirt. I don't vape. Don't worry. <laughs> love you guys. Bye, loves.